Hi, we're with the Canadian Press and we're going to show you how to make a pinhole camera for safe viewing of the solar eclipse this Monday. So all you'll need is a sheet of white paper, a pair of scissors, a push pin or another type of pin that can make a really small hole. Uh, you need some scotch tape, a pencil or a pen, a piece of aluminum foil, and any kind of cardboard box will do, but you can do a cereal box or a shoe box or anything that's of similar shape like this. So the first thing you need to do is trace your box on the white piece of paper, which you will later cut out. And all you need to do with that, and you can use a little bit of scotch tape to secure it, is just place it inside the box on the end, which will be your projector side. And then, you just need to cut two holes at the top of your box facing each other and then I'm going to do the same on the other side. So you'll be left with this flap if you're using a cereal box so all you just have to do is secure it with tape and then you take one hole that you cut and you cover it with aluminum foil and then you can just secure that with tape as well. So once you've done that you just take your push pin or any pin that will make a tiny hole like this and just make sure that you have a clean even hole so like that and then that's really it during the eclipse you will stand with your back facing the sun so you're turned away your face is not facing the sun your back is turned to the sun and then you're looking through this hole and trying to position yourself so that this tiny little hole that you made here in the aluminum foil uh, will cast a projection of the sun and the eclipse as it's happening on that white sheet of paper that we've taped to the back of the box. So you'll just need to sort of maneuver yourself around depending on where you're standing outside until you start to see a tiny little projection of the sun on the back of the box. And once you see that, you're all set to view the eclipse. And as it happens, you'll see a crescent projected onto the back of the white paper inside the box and this is a safe way to see the eclipse if you don't want to look at it directly or if you don't have safe solar eclipse sunglasses.